Hello, I'm Rutherford Kidd, and I'd like to talk with you about the SA, the IEEE Standards Association. You might already know the IEEE by reputation. The IEEE has been producing standards for over a century, and if you're involved in the electrotechnology world, you're probably familiar with the role IEEE standards have played in the history of electricity and electronics. The SA nurtures, develops, and advances new technology standards in the marketplace, and in so doing, it magnifies the transformational impact of these technologies on businesses and society as a whole. The SA's role as an international center for collaborative work derives from the IEEE's long and distinguished history, its broadly dispersed geographical membership, and the quality and breadth of its technical work. The well-established IEEE standards process is based on consensus, openness, balance, and due process, all of which impose a discipline that helps ensure fairness and high-quality technical results that can be adopted with confidence worldwide. Part of what has made IEEE standards so successful and influential is the rigor of that process. Most often, a project's advocate or leader finds a technical sponsor within the IEEE, typically within an IEEE society. Once that is accomplished, the sponsor applies to the SA to formally launch the project. A working group is assembled, and an administrative structure comprising volunteers, staff, and policy documents sets out to guide the effort through the process. A standard is drafted, often through an iterative process of voting and modifying. Once the draft is stable, it is subjected to a highly formalized ballot, which includes a carefully balanced group of stakeholders. This, too, can be an iterative process. This classic process is used more today than ever. The SA has more than 900 active standards, with hundreds more under development, and Increasingly, the results are adaptable to an international user market, which also requires them to be interrelated or interoperable. For many projects, this approach continues to be the way to go. But these days, that's just the beginning. Today's essay has evolved into a flexible, well-connected, international partner that empowers corporations and technology groups of all sizes and types organizations that have a spectrum of goals. At the core of it is still the classic IEEE standardization process Rutherford just described. But today's essay wraps this classic core in a variety of standards-related services that extend from the nurturing of a technology area way prior to the creation of the standard all the way through market implementation. We call this complete process, from before the beginning to after the end, the full standards life cycle. The essay provides a single venue, one-stop development, you might say, where this full life cycle can be optimized. The essay can guide a potential project through the process of assembling an appropriate group. When the time comes, the essay guides the group through its standards process, from permission to launch a standards project to ultimate approval, and even beyond to marketing services, public data registries, consortium creation, and liaisons with other IEEE entities and services. So the standards lifecycle takes the traditional consensus standards and adds value, from customized services to positioning the work within a larger framework. One reason the SA is so influential is its commitment to openness, which characterizes not only the standards process, but also the way the SA does business in general, the way it approaches challenges and business opportunities, for example. And that openness to new ideas, to alternatives, has led to an essay program designed for groups that need flexibility beyond traditional process, or require a faster turnaround, or don't yet require broad consensus, or maybe are faced with an unusual market situation. The essay has staked out new territory in addressing the needs of these projects. Let's let Julia explain. Think of the traditional IEEE standardization process as a house with hallways, rooms, and stairs. Structures that define the space, give it meaning. Well, 
The same concept applies to a well-defined process for creating something. The life cycle concept adds appliances, furniture, design consultation, and infrastructure to this solid base. And it can also give the building a name and place it in the neighborhood. But sometimes what you need is a customizable loft. The Industry Connections lets a group put together the various resources of the IEEE and the Standards Association in a customized fashion and produce content of any kind that may or may not include traditional IEEE standards. In other words, the content can run the gamut from standards coming through the traditional process all the way to white papers, textbooks, educational materials, videos and machinima, specialized tools, social networking spaces, feeds, online databases, conferences. Sort of the best of both, or maybe several worlds. Basically, Industry Connections is the umbrella under which a group can combine any of our resources however they like optimized for their particular project, with or without a classic IEEE standardization project being involved. So, if you're involved in electrotechnology, from medical devices to power plants to, well, virtual worlds, or anything in between, and if you're looking for a home for your work, we hope you'll see the IEEE as the place for international standards development with a broad range of associated services. From project initiation through branding to market coordination. Consider the SA the one-stop center for a full range of services. Whether you need the rigor of the classic IEEE standards process. Or maybe that process combined with any of a range of support services. Or a new and unique environment to deliver advanced content or address specialized needs. The IEEE SA is the place to make transformation from concept to market. IEEE, fostering technological innovation and excellence for the benefit of humanity. We hope you've enjoyed this quick look at today's essay. Please visit our website for more information. And check out our campus under construction on IEEE Island in Second Life. Contact your IEEE liaison, your personal content and process consultant. Tell us what you have in mind, and we'll help you make it happen. I'm Julia Brunet. I'm Jason Brown. And I'm Rutherford Kidd. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you soon.